So I have been trying to test the air quality at my place. So naturally, I went to Amazon and searched for air quality monitor, right? Of course not. That wouldn't be fun, and you would be disappointed. I build my own using Arduino. Let me show you what I have. Maybe you can make your own too. So I connected this air quality sensor to my text passion shield and look here i'm displaying the air quality the lower the number the better so if we go lower on the number that means the better the quality see to prove a point i'm going to take this sensor i'm going to put it on top of the air air purifier and you will see the number will drop so let me get the camera here and then take a look so when I put the sensor on top of the air purifier, the value or the number drops. And if I take it away, it's going to go up. And that's just to prove that the sensor is working. I did connect this to my text passion shield, which makes it easier. I do have a full video about the text passion shield if you're interested. Now, let me go to the PC and give you the code and everything you need if you want to build this for yourself. Let's talk about the wiring real quick. So let's start with the obvious. You have voltage and ground, and that's 5 volt and ground. There is D0 and A0. We are skipping the D0 for now and connecting the A0 to the A3. Now, you can connect that to the A0, A1, or any of the analog pins. I'm using A3 in this scenario here. Now, this is the text passion shield. I do have a full video about this thing here, but for now and for the purpose of this video, think about it like an Arduino, a sensor, and an OLED. So this is the OLED connected to the Arduino, and that's the air quality sensor here. I'm just using the Arduino to read the sensor value and display that on the OLED. I will give you the code and I will leave a link in the description for that. If you want to learn more about the text passion shield, I made that available for you in another video, which I will leave a link to it in the description and I highly recommend you check it out. Let's go to the PC so I can give you the code real quick. Now we are here on the computer. Let's go over the code real quick which I'm going to post on my website and leave a link in the description for you to copy and paste. These are just some libraries that you might want to install unless they are already in your Arduino IDE. This is the pins declaration for the OLED, and this is the pin for the air quality sensor. Down here, we are beginning the OLED, checking the OLED, and clearing the display. This is the function that is reading the air quality pin value and then displaying it here on the OLED screen. This is just a delay, one second, so we can update the screen every one second. Now, I'm just displaying the value right away. In the future, you might want to do like a condition where, let's say, if the value is under 200, then you would display very good quality or excellent quality, something like that. Now, between 200 and 300, maybe we'd say good. And then 300 to 400, you would say okay. And then anything over 400 would, or 500 would be poor quality, something like that. So you can have a, a more meaningful text to show the air quality based on that value. But I wanted to give you this, like the raw integer number. So you can do whatever you want with it. Also, I wanted to keep it simple for the purpose of this demo. So I hope this is helpful. And once again, I will leave links in the description for everything you need to make this for yourself. This is it for this video. Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next one.